If you have a presentation as a PDF with one slide per page, in this case we have a presentation of 16 slides, and you want to print more than one slide on each page to save on printing and on paper, if you go to File and Print, you can see that at the moment it's going to print 16 pages with one slide on each page. Choosing the multiple option allows you to put more than one slide on each page. In this case we could, we start with two slides side by side, but we could have it two by two and see what happens when we click and apply that. So just click somewhere else. So here we have a two by two matrix. We have it in landscape or in portrait. So in this case it would make more sense to, if you want them printed as big as possible, to choose landscape. And you can see now that it's going to put four on each page and it's going to take, uh, instead of 16 pages, it's going to take four pages. If we wanted, we could change it to two by one. And in this case, I'll change it back to land to portrait. And in fact, actually, if I make it one by two, and you can see now that I have two slides per page and it's going to take eight pages. So again, you just click on multiple, you choose how many uh, slides you want to fit onto the one page and then choose as appropriate landscape or portrait to fit it as large as you want it on the slide, on the handout. And the only other thing is that you may wish to flip on the long short edge rather than the long edge. In this case, if you flip on the long edge, it means that the of the second page and the first page will look the same. It'll be printed back to back. But if you have, uh, for example, when we're doing two by two in landscape, you would want to flip on the short edge because you want to flip it on this side here. Okay, that's it. It just is a quick way of saving on printing costs and on paper.